Is summer over already? Yes. It's over June 6th. Yeah. <laughs> Not really over. We have other summer adventures. But Missy's summer academic adventure begins today. Yep. It's funner than just school, though, isn't it? Yeah, it is more fun. Activities and and stuff. every Friday we do fun things. So That's it's, awesome. And we only have five classes instead of seven. Oh, so they're okay. longer. But oh, okay. Yeah. So she starts her college summer program today. Upward bound. Yep. And uh, she'll be doing this. How, it's an eight-week program? Six-week program? It's six weeks. I don't know. It ends in, like, the middle of July, so. Well, great. And we've got girls camp next week, and whew, we've got adventures mm -hmm. coming up. But that sounds a lot. <laughs> but, yeah. I hope you have a wonderful first day. Me too. <laughs> This means she's anxious because she's moving her knees. Oh, I did. <laughs> I'm anxious. <laughs> Love you. Love oh, you too. You're gonna be all right. Yeah. I will. Hopefully. Bye. I hope so too. Bye, Dolly. I'm proud of her. This is a lot to do during the summer, but it'll pay off, I think. She just, she does enjoy structure. and I think this will be really good for her. Well, it was good for her last year. We'll see how it goes this year. I'm doing a little bit of giggling in my garden. Yes, I am. Look how cute. And then, right there. Oh, and oh, no, that was the first one. Right there. Yeah, right there. I don't remember how, oh, right there. We spaced them out. Because they're green beans. Then I made a video for myself showing what plants are what. And I gotta look back because I don't remember what was what. Looks like some of those seed pods. I don't know, maybe that's normal. Um, no growth in these yet and it's hard to know what's weed and what's plant and so we'll, we'll wait on those um a little bit of growth over here cute nothing in that little pathetic pile two things here nothing here but here um these are my cantaloupe. Oh, that came out. So, nothing there yet, unless, see, I just don't know. Oh, that might be cantaloupe. Anyway, nothing there yet. Oh, the weeds! <laughs> she's learning, and I appreciate that. She's not in here. She's been yelled at plenty of times. So, a little bit at a time, a little bit at a time, I need to get out here and weed. Hey, get out! Go! I spoke too soon. But that's exciting for my beans coming up. My sweet potatoes are intermixed with that mess and they're looking good. My tomatoes are looking good. I've given up on the peas, but I need to look real close and see if I have any um, beets popping up. Maybe I do, you guys. <laughs> There's a whole bunch of those little friends popping up, so I bet those are beets. Weeds don't grow in a row like that. So I did some of those as well. And then my corn is popping up. See? No. I'm just excited. I am just excited. We did some decorative corn over here, but they're old seeds, so they may not even come up. The goats, you can see, stuck their head through that panel and ate down most of my asparagus. Hopefully that doesn't, you're not supposed to harvest for another like year, so hopefully that works. If you want to put up panels to save my other stuff, we just didn't think they could get that far in. We were wrong, but my tomatoes are looking good. So, uh, that's exciting going better than last year. 
it's all you can ask for. It's a little bit better every year. I did plant a whole bunch of sunflowers along the entire side of the fence. Um, hopefully they pop up. So a lot of stress and anxiety has gone into this, <laughs> this garden. So looks like we have some. <laughs> we'll see how many pop up. We have sunflowers. We do. We do. Yeah, there's a bunch of them. Yay! We need a weed. But yeah, there's a bunch. Pretty. Yeah, we've got a bunch of stuff growing. Nice. Yes. Too. Not a deworm, the goats. How was Upward Brown today? Boring. Boring. <laughs> Just because we don't, we didn't do much today, but we're going to do schoolwork. We're going to start classes tomorrow. So. so today was a day of socializing and she was not happy. They wouldn't let me read. So mean a school that well, won't let you read. Well, they wanted me to socialize. I understand. And I understand that. But well, you didn't want to. I wanted to read. <laughs> I'm sorry. Fine. Hopefully tomorrow will be better. Less yeah. socializing. Well, we're in <laughs> class, so. <laughs> oh, exciting. Exciting, exciting. Exciting. Should I say it a few more times? No. Exciting. We finally got rain today, a good amount, so everything needed it. Everything. So I'm really... I'm really glad to see some growth. Do you want deworming balls, Lula? <laughs> Atlas, you jumping on the wall? Hmm? Hi, Athena. They're excited to be in the barn today. <laughs> Normally we lock them out for the day, but it's been rainy, so they've been inside. Little brats. Huh. They're not that small. I know. Is that you? That was, that was um, several years ago. Somebody was crying, and I said, "You're being you're being a brat. You're being a brat." And we're Sanders. not bad. We're not bad. He was really upset that I called him a bat. <laughs> right. Let's see. Let's go. Lock hands. So everybody needs to know. You little turd. Everybody needs two. I have to be really careful to make sure. Don't eat my hand. So now the problem is going to be getting them theirs without the other two being done. Come on, hurry. Eat it. Ah, go. Oh. Ooh, but, oh my gosh. Go away. It's funny because they will eat it on their grain, but they'll eat it like. Right. Well, oh, get off me. There goes my shirt. Ah, I've been eating my goats. <laughs> this is stupid. You bite me, I will bite you back. Wouldn't that be a sign, a scene? That would okay. be, I'd love Gosh. to see you try. All right. Nobody was bit in the process of this, of making this food, maybe. I survived. I do a weekly herbal dewormer. I normally do it on warming Wednesdays, but Wednesday got away from me last week, so we're doing warming Mondays. Incriminating hoof prints on my shirt. The kids planted some sunflowers like over here. Right along here. Randomly. Um, do you see any popping up? A couple over here. Wasn't it a few days after, or was it that same day? From what? When I planted mine. No, it was a couple days after. Oh, okay. A so, couple here, and like a couple here. It'll just be fun to see what pops up. Yep. Uh, Maybe it doesn't go past right, uh, like the end. Right here. Is it grass like? Okay. We'll see what happens. Sarah left out like three packets of sunflower seeds like for a couple of days and it rained so I was like well you might as well plant them all so I don't think they actually planted all of them but they planted a good amount I may go ahead and plant some more in the garden just because why not and I don't feel like I can keep them for days and days because they got wet days and days years and years 
I'm checking on the turkey nest. Sophie's checking on it too. Go on. Oh, the trap's closed. Nothing's in it other than the turkey eggs though. Turkeys probably have found a new spot. There was a nest there. Um, one of the turkeys gets out on the daily and hides her nest. So, not sure exactly where her nest is. I don't like traipsing around these um, tall grasses. It scares me. So, we had a predator taking the eggs. So, we put this out, but it looks like it got closed. Eggs are still in it, but nothing else. So, Sophie's actually really good at finding the nest. Oh, looks like we lost a branch off of one of the trees. But, so she comes out with an egg. Then, I know. Oh, that's heavy. I'm glad we didn't lose the fence. Maybe I'll leave it there so we don't lose it in the ground. But, um, yeah, in Idaho, we used her quite a bit to find our turkey nests. My fear fear would be that she will, the turkey will hide on her nest and then we don't know where she's at and then she's susceptible to predators. That happened in Idaho as well. So I just need to, I don't know. We just, I don't know what we need to do with them. So one day at a time is what, it's how I'm rolling. Dive bombed in the face with a bug so excited so all this we can use the electric netting to run the goats through pasture areas like this so with us getting the fencing up for the goats and not using the electric netting on a full-time basis we'll be able to rotate the goats in different pastures we'll probably build some kind of a temporary um shelter that can be drug around with them because goats don't like rain so when it rains they can go somewhere to be dry but homesteads coming together and it's taken time but in Idaho we jumped into animals pretty quick like we I think we got too many too fast and we didn't have the proper infrastructure and everything set up so here we decided that we we're gonna take it slower um, and in all honesty, we probably shouldn't have done the turkeys when we did, so, but that's okay. I mean, I would like to have a better setup for them. I would like to use them. I would like to have the rabbits used for the purpose they are. Right now, they're just pets that are fertilizing the grass, which isn't a waste. That's still a, a good purpose, but um, it's hard to be patient. It's really hard to be patient, but I'm just so grateful for the hard work Jonah's putting in with the fencing. <clears throat> Excuse me. And it's been so enjoyable. I've spent a lot of work and time with him doing the fencing. So that's been, it's been quite enjoyable to work together and to do hard things. And I'm just thrilled that my garden is growing. So I admit that um, I didn't have a lot of faith. I, I just, I'm not real, I used to garden a lot when we lived in Utah. And then when we moved to Idaho, the ground just wasn't great. And we had our own set of trials there. And so moving here, it's like you have to relearn to garden again. But I'm grateful that there's a longer growing season. So it's a little bit more forgiving. And I've learned a lot this year. And it, there was a lot of anxiety planting the garden, but the seeds are being gracious. Sophie! <laughs> and they um, ignored my anxiety and they're growing anyway. Let's go save this from Sophie. Where'd you put it? Hi. Where is it? There it is. Okay, just wanna make sure it was not upside down. <laughs> you leave my friends alone. Come on, you dug for the, ah, leave it. You dug for that one too, didn't you? Come on, let's go. Ah, 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 ah. Sophie, leave it. Where, where did you get that? Probably. Huh. You gonna show me where you got it? Where'd you get it? Huh? Where'd you get it? 
There you go, buddy. Come on, inside. Uh -uh. Come on. Hey. Come on. Uh -uh. Come on. Good girl. Uh -uh. Come on. You think you're so, so sneaky, don't you? Drop it. Drop it. Good girl. Come on. Come on. Good girl. Come on. <laughs>